Hal Berry, a well-known person in the entertainment world, has made a big impression on many people with her work. Whether it's a story that inspires you or a moment from one of her acting roles that you remember, people feel a connection with her. We'd love to hear about your favorite memories or experiences with this famous actor. Share your stories below as we explore interesting and surprising facts about Hal Berry in the video. Keep watching for more. Your stories help make the whole picture more interesting, so please share. Hal Berry, a Cleveland, Ohio native, grew up in a predominantly white suburb with her mother, a psychiatric nurse, and her father, a hospital attendant. When she was four, her parents divorced and her mom raised her and her older sister alone. As a child, Barry faced racism and often felt like an outsider. Despite these challenges, she showed talent and determination early on. Involved in various activities such as cheerleading and beauty pageants, her experiences fueled her ambition to become an actress. After high school, Barry pursued her dream, studying at Cuyahoga Kamalantarunity College before transferring to a larger university. Eventually, she dropped out to chase her acting aspirations, moving to Chicago and then New York City. In New York City, financial struggles led to her briefly living in a homeless shelter. Her breakthrough came when she won the Miss Teen All-American pageant and later competed in the Miss Usa pageant, finishing as the first runner-up. This exposure helped her land modeling gigs and acting roles in TV shows like Living Dolls and Knott's Landing. Talent and perseverance led to more significant opportunities with notable roles in films like Jungle Fever and Boomerang. However, it was her role in Monsters Ball that earned critical acclaim, making her the first African-American woman to win the Academy Award for Best Actress. Despite setbacks and challenges, Barry's determination, talent, and resilience shaped her career, propelling her to become one of Hollywood's most respected and influential actresses. Hal Barry's mother, who comes from Liverpool, England, has an interesting story that's tied to her daughter's journey in showbiz. In a certain year, September, she met Alex Da Kid through mutual friends in the entertainment scene, which was a big moment for her. This meeting led to connections that later affected her career path. Then, in another year's November, she decided to relaunch her lingerie line, Scandal. This move show would not just her spirit as a business person, but also her determination to try different things beyond acting. These events show how varied her personal and professional life is, highlighting her strong ties in the industry and her determination to explore new paths to success. She keeps going in Hollywood with grace and strength, making a lasting impression. In short, Hal Berry's mother's journey shows how important it is to keep going and make meaningful connections to chase your dreams. Her story is one of ambition, strength, and a drive to succeed in the entertainment world. In 22, Hal Berry made a lasting impression at the Oscars when her dress was voted the most popular in the ceremony's first 75 years. This recognition highlighted her influence on the fashion scene during that famous event. Earlier in her career, she took on the role of Corey in The Last Boy Scout. Originally, director Tony Scott had considered casting Grace Jones for the small part, but the producers had a different opinion. They opposed the idea and ultimately chose her for the role. This decision played a pivotal role in shaping the movie and her trajectory in the industry. In 2003, she faced a notable career choice when she turned down the female lead in the box office disaster Jiggly. Interestingly, this decision indirectly led to the formation of the high-profile relationship between Ben Affleck and Jennifer Lopez. Her career choices not only shape her path, but also have ripple effects in the broader entertainment landscape. In Sumo Andereri, her influence stretches beyond her acting skills, reaching into the realms of fashion choices and the dynamics of casting decisions in the film industry. Initially declining the role of Jean in the movie Executive Decision, the actress had a change of heart when offered a staggering $1 million for the job. This marked her first million-dollar payment for a film, a significant milestone in her career. Despite her initial hesitation, the allure of such a substantial paycheck was too enticing to pass up. Interestingly, it wasn't just the money that drew her back to the project. There was something about the character of Jean that intrigued her, prompting her to reconsider. Perhaps it was the complexity of the role or the chance to showcase her talents in a different way. In 2005, she found herself ranked fifth in FHM Magazine's 100 Sexiest Women in the World Supplement. This recognition further solidified her status as a leading actress, admired not only for her acting skills, but also for her undeniable beauty and charisma. Despite her rising fame and success, she remained grounded and focused on her work. 
Even after becoming a mother and experiencing the joys of parenthood, she didn't let it slow her down. Just eight months after giving birth to her daughter Nala, she was back on set, ready to tackle her next project, Frankie and Alice. It's a story of dedication and passion for her work. She didn't let anything stand in the way of pursuing her dreams and making her impact in the film industry. Her journey continues to inspire aspiring actors and actresses around the world. And that's how she took on the role of Jean in Executive Decision, marking her first million-dollar payment for a film and solidifying her status as one of Hollywood's most recognized figures. Hal Berry, known for her memorable roles in movies like Executive Decision and Bullworth, has made a big impact in Hollywood. She was even listed in Maxim Magazine's Hot 100 Women in 2007, ranking 55th. Initially hesitant, she agreed to a $1 million salary for her part in Executive Decision alongside Oliver Platt and Michael Milholm. Together, they gave a really good performance in Bullworth, showing Barry's talent and versatility. Her journey in entertainment shows she's a big deal in Hollywood, celebrated for what she's done in movies. This story tells the tale of her career, marked by resilience, talent, and dedication to acting. Actress Hal Berry, a mother of two, welcomed her daughter Nala Aubrey on March 16, 2008, with ex-boyfriend Gabriel Aubrey. Later, she became a mother again to a son named Maceo Martinez, born on October 5, 2013, with her estranged husband, Olivier Martinez. In an interesting turn of events, Berry adopted a cat originally cast as an extra in the film Catwoman. The cat was initially named Plato, but Barry felt it was too serious, so she changed it to Plato, injecting some fun into the name. Harvard University's Hasty Pudding Theatricals recognized Barry's achievements in 2006, honoring her as their Woman of the Year. This award acknowledges her contributions to the entertainment industry and her impact on popular culture. In her personal life, Barry's choices reflect her curiosity and desire to learn, as seen in her decision to adopt Plato to better understand cats. Beyond her professional achievements, these personal aspects offer insight into the woman behind the screen. Hal Berry, originally from Cleveland, but raised in Oakwood Village, OH, maintained strong connections with her family in the area. Despite achieving global fame, she values the roots that tie her to her upbringing. In 26, she secured the sixth spot in FHM Magazine's list of the 100 sexiest women in the world, highlighting her lasting allure and charm. Her parents, Judith Ann Hawkins and Jerome Jesse Berry, separated when she was just four years old, leading her to be primarily raised by her mother. This early experience shaped her resilience and independence, qualities that later defined her career and personal life. While researching the role of Dorothy Dandridge, she made a fascinating discovery both she and the legendary actress were born in the same Cleveland hospital. This unexpected connection added a deep layer of meaning to her portrayal of Dandridge, enhancing her understanding of the woman she brought to life on screen. Hal Berry's journey from a modest upbringing in Ohio to global stardom showcases her talent, determination, and perseverance. She continues to inspire countless fans worldwide with grace, poise, and unwavering Kamalam treatment to her craft.